Hello everyone, it's Limzy here and welcome back to my channel. Mother's Day is just around the corner and I thought it would be fun if I could share on how to draw a Mother's Day card. It is a simple yet design-oriented card that we could elevate from our daily doodles. So let's get started. Let's start off with a blank A4 paper and fold it in half. And then we're gonna write the word MUM in caps with block design. So just grab a ruler and a pencil. And draw a horizontal line on top of your paper and another line at the bottom. This will be the height of your lattice. And then just divide the width into three parts. It doesn't have to be super exact as long as it looks quite equal visually, then that would be just fine. Starting from the left, let's draw out the letter M and block design. We're going to make use of the positive space inside the letter itself. So make sure that it's pretty spacious and good enough for us to fill up flowers and foliage later on. Then moving on to O, you can point out four middle points on each side to help draw out a nice even O shape like what I'm doing here. And then just repeat another M for the last letter. Now here comes the fun part. So just grab your ink pen and from the first letter M, start filling up the positive space with all sorts of flowers and foliage of your own choice. Here I'm doodling some simple flowers, daisies, pointy leaves, eucalyptus leaves to make them compact together to fill up the entire M letter. And we're gonna keep on doodling like this for the rest of the letters as well. I'm quite sure you will have fun doing this, so just go with the flow of your pen and strokes. Make sure that most parts of the perimeter of your letters are covered with leaves or flowers so that they will gradually shape out the letter itself. So the same thing goes to letter O. Here I'm repeating similar types of flowers that I've done before, filling up the space with flowers and foliage without thinking too much. That's the best part of doodling. Although this looks sophisticated and a bit complicated, they're actually formed by very simple flower drawings grouped together to form a unique garden of its own. Here, as I finish O, I quickly shift the same flora and foliage elements to the last M, just filling up the positive space really quickly and freely. Once you're done, just grab some color pencils or markers to give this mum floral alphabet some bright colors. Here I'm using Stabilo Aquacolor color pencils to dress up the elements inside, starting with some warm colors like this pink for the flowers, and then moving on to some yellow, and then some red. I just scribble the colors really quickly as I will give it some water later on. You can also use highlighters or colored markers of your own choice. Here, I'm painting the leaves in some fresh green and turquoise, quickly filling up the colors from left to right.
Now this part is optional, but if you are using watercolor pencils like mine, just grab a brush and add some water and just run your brush through the colors across the paper, further blending the colors for a smooth finishing. And your word mum is gonna be completed in no time. So once you're done and the colors are dried up, simply erase off the pencil marks and don't you love how this card turns out to be? You can implement this idea to other words or designs or with different elements inside the letters. So I hope that you have joined me and painted along because this is such a great practice for floral tools. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel or even leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this creative Mother's Day card. I will see you again. Be kind to one another. Bye bye.